Hi, I'm uh, John Bernthal. I play Shane Walsh. Uh, uh, Shane is, uh, is Rick's best friend and is his partner, and uh, he uh, he does everything he, he possibly can to, to honor his best friend and, and keep his. Uh, <laughs> I, th I think I think they've read the comic book. <laughs> I'm really excited to be here, uh, and, uh, uh, but, but but seriously, this is uh, this is amazing, and uh, I I can't believe how how many of you are there are, and we are really trying to get this right for all of you, and and if it's half as good as it feels, we're really doing it. And thank you so much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
I, I came all the way to Hollywood and I was really excited and uh, I ended up in Frank's camera house <laughs> doing, doing the scene with John and it was, uh, it was amazing, amazing. And Boss the dog, his dog, yeah. Um, but I just, you know, it's been, as John said, it's, this is wild. We do, we're still midway through episode four and um, just to see this and to realize who we're doing it for and um, the loyalty and the devotion that you guys show to this comic book is mind-blowing and it's a, it is a real privilege and honor to be here and to work with such esteemed people as Gail and Frank and AMC so um, yeah it, this is this is the golden ticket I've got. Before this, I'm sorry, not this again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, need, you need at least one. Fair enough. Um, but before this, I'd actually never read a comic book and I'd never seen a horror movie. I'm a card carrying chicken and Greg Nicotero has ruined my life. <laughs> I, I'm not kidding, I haven't really, you know, my, my part of this show has been less, uh, until recently, less of a, a zombie show and more of a, a show about family and community and, and, and communication and breakdown and, and surviving. And so in the last week, um, I've been going home trying to get out of my head what this show has put in. She met the zombies. I, you guys, uh, I'm not kidding. I woke up this morning like this, like shaking, fists balled, eyes squeezed shut, coming out of a nightmare. This show may, um, yeah, go ahead and make a terrorist movie. <laughs> I think I could have Frank Baber sometimes too, but... <laughs> we need to go in. So, I also heard that you guys are shooting in Atlanta, and it's something like 110 degrees and humid. At night. 110. <laughs> Try 150, too. I'm not kidding. On the roof? Was it how, how, how much? 152 degrees. I don't, I don't, uh, I don't doubt that. So the heat gets is kicked up off the surface of that room. Jesus, I, if, if you watch this show, just bear one thing in mind. I, I, I lost uh, 15 pounds. It's actually a great diet. <laughs> go, direct the mo go direct the movie for 15 days and you'll be 15 pounds, uh, you know, a pound a day. <laughs> Sweated right off. Everybody has just been so, our asses have been kicked by this heat. And, I, I, you know, theirs more so than mine because they're there all the time. Uh, it is the AMC diet. <laughs> well, how are you guys? Available on our website. Available on our website. So, how are you guys adapting to the heat? What are you doing to deal with it? The, the action and the yeah. Yeah. Well, I, I would so, I would soak cold towels uh, in ice water and sea breeze. Uh, I would soak the, these towels. Uh, in uh, in ice water and put ice cold towel. I'd wear towels on my head on the set to keep from passing out. Because uh, I, 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 this is taking nothing away from what you guys have been going through. But they get to stand, you know, under an umbrella in between between takes. I'm running around like a lunatic on a road out there, going, "No, you gotta shoot the guy from here." So I'm like, you know, there were moments where I thought I was gonna go over. The towels saved me. Well, and we shot till 5.30 in the morning yesterday, and then the cast and I got on a plane and flew here, and the first thing that Andy and John and I did was run and jump in the ocean, which was freezing cold, but we just kept thinking, remember how hot it is in Atlanta? Oh, we didn't care, so that was the greatest thing.